guys welcome to my channel my name is Chanel if you're new make sure to subscribe and hit that bell so that way when I post another video you can get the notification and welcome back if you're not okay so today's video I'm coming from outside um, I wanted a new scenery than from inside with my lighting I want to be I want to be talking about faith today so I'm just gonna get right into it so Back in 2016, me and my mom were, we were riding down the road and I seen a car. It was a Chevrolet Malibu to be exact. I don't know quite exactly what model it was, maybe like a 2008 to, to a 2012, maybe, I'm not too sure. You guys, I seen that car and something ignited inside of me. I was just like, oh my gosh, look at that car. Like, that thing is beautiful. Like, I'm going to get that. And I was just telling my mom, like, mom, that's my car. I'm going to get that. I got so stoked and so excited that I almost forgot that I was driving. Like, that's how excited I got. Like, that was just the confidence in me. That was my faith, like, building up inside of me. Like, I just knew. I didn't have any doubt. I didn't have no fear. None of that. Like, I just knew from deep down, like, from somewhere in my heart, inside my body, that I knew that I was going to get it. So, months go down the line. You guys, I don't know what's going on. Like, I think mosquitoes or something is out here. But you know, I don't do, I don't do the insects like that. And it's hot today. Okay, anyway. So, we're driving down the road. I was like, I seen this car. Oh, mom, that's mine, that's mine. You know, I was having faith. Like, I just knew I was going to get it. Then months go down the line. And I overhear my sister and my sister's friend in the living room. And they were talking about the car yet and she was like no I gotta get the insurance and yada 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 all this extra stuff and I'm just in the room overhearing this eavesdropping I know it's not right but I heard it I was just like mm, you wanna get me a car that I was just speaking to myself in the room and I'm just like okay well let me not get my hopes up too much so I'm just like I'm just gonna leave it alone and just give it a couple of days so you guys one morning I wake up and my sister she calls me and she's like um well we got you a car and I was like what like how did this even happen and I you not like way way before I seen the car any sorts like that me and my sister we were going around town at dealerships looking at cars seeing how much I had to put down at that point I was getting discouraged I'm like oh my goodness I gotta work 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 my behind off just to get this money to put a down payment and go through all this extra stuff then, now we're going to fast forward. When she calls me, she's like, she gives me the whole lowdown. And I even, I've said, I was just like, uh, sis, did you tell me? Um, I overheard, well, not tell me, I overheard, you know, you and so-and-so talk. And she was like, yeah, that was, it was in the making. I didn't want to tell you yet until we had everything confirmed that it's yours. And I'm just like, What? She was like, yeah, I'm going to drive it. Um, I'm going to drive it to work just to make sure everything's okay. And then you'll get it tomorrow morning. And I'm like, wow. <sighs> okay. So, guys, what I'm trying to say is that faith, if you have faith the size of a mustard seed, you can move mountains. Do you not know how much authority that you have? All you have to do is speak it out your mouth. You have power of life and death in the tongue. Whatever you speak, so shall it happen. So shall it become in the atmosphere. And I spoke my car into existence. Like, I kept speaking it. And mind you not, I kept seeing a car around town. And I'm just like, God, this is truly a sign that this car is mine. And I just kept speaking and kept speaking. And even though I also prayed as well to you guys. And I'm just like, I'm just going to, I don't want to think too hard about it. I'm just going to pray and I'm going to speak that I have it through faith. And I'm not going to doubt or I'm not going to fear. And one thing about it, when you're speaking faith, it's also a little bit, a little bit, a little peck of doubt but you know what just just counsel that out with a positive with a positive mindset with a positive with, with, with a positive attitude and thought you can over out a lot 
you guys. And in James chapter 2, verse 17 says, faith without works is dead. Let me tell you something. You have to work your faith in order for you to get your desired outcome. You can't sit up here and say, oh, I want a car, I want a car, I want a job, I want a job, I want this husband, I want these children. You have to work for it, honey. You can't sit up here and just pop your collar and think you're supposed to sit pretty all the time. You got to go out there and do what's necessary. Not trying to say material-wise, but spiritual-wise. Like, read your word, you know, pray, worship, get into a small group, connect with others. That's what builds your faith as well, too. Don't be isolated and just think negative, any sorts of like that. Just have faith, you guys. I mean, it's so awesome. And you know one thing about it? Like, you cannot please God without it. If you want God's heart, if you want his want heart, his, you guys, if you, if you want him to move in your life, you have to have faith. Don't be negative, boo-boo. Faith without works is dead, okay? Hey guys, so that was just okay. my little story time. Just a little talk about faith. And there are plenty, plenty other stories that I had also and have and that are continuing right now in the process of me having faith. But that was just one that really just sparked up inside of me. And guys, right now my car is still sitting here in the yard and it's almost paid off. I have one more payment. Tell me that ain't God. <laughs> anyway you guys hopefully that you like that story time this little clip quick video or whatnot um make sure you subscribe and hopefully i will see you in my next video peace and blessings see ya